Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So if you have accepted that you're weird, feel free to stay. And by stay, I mean make sure that you hit subscribe and turn on post notifications so that you're notified every single time I upload a video. So please do not shoot me. I'm just a messenger. Okay, I'm a conduit. I'm a messenger from the ancestral plane to here to the living earthlings. So basically, I'm back with another unpopular opinions again, but uh this one is just home edition. Like do not invite me if you do any of these things in your house. Or if you don't do them, do not invite me to your house. I don't if you're easily offended, yeah. this video is not for you. Reminder, you chose to click this video, okay? I didn't make you click this, you chose to click this video. People that empty their bins or that wait for the kitchen bin to be full, their food waste bin in particular to be full before emptying it, your demons, your actual demons. Listen, first of all, have you ever seen maggots? Have you seen a maggot? Like, it, I'm gonna put a picture here. Have you seen a maggot? That's what's gonna happen to your bin. That's what's gonna happen in your, like your kitchen's gonna be infested with maggots. Please, please, my pet peeve, the biggest thing that annoys me is when I see people in their kitchen, they have a massive 50 litre pedal, whatever, foot pedal bin and whatever and whatnot. I already know you don't empty that bin every day. I already know you're gonna wait until that bin is full to then empty it. You do not empty that bin every day. Like, who? Like, ew? No, get out. No, please stop doing that. Like, get there's a reason why those little small food waste bins exist. Why do you think food waste bins are that small? It's to encourage people to throw them out on a daily basis. Okay? The most you can go is two days. Okay? Two days without emptying it. But even by then, it's already smelling anyway. And also, let's not forget, like, right now, it's been doing summer, 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 summer. You wait till the bin is full. Hey. Going to have new tenants in your house. Going to have new tenants, and you bring the mum, the dad, the children, the children's children, the grandkids, the nephews, the nieces, the other extended family you didn't know about, the family that your dad, okay, the family that the dad had on the side and you didn't know, the family that the mum had on the side but she didn't know, the long lost kids, the kids that the mum gave up for adoption before she met the dad. Next, unpopular opinion. Uh, <laughs> Um, so this one, it's, I, uh, listen, there's certain parts within a house that needs to be cleaned every day without fail. Ev like, I, I, literally, I mean this every mother freaking day, it needs to be cleaned, not tidied up, no, I mean cleaned. And I'm talking, let, let's start with the kitchen, okay? The kitchen, first off, you gotta empty your bin every day. Two days if you're lazy, okay, fine. <laughs> the sink okay i don't know if it's just me but like i have this thing that i feel like i have to wash the sink clean the sink before i wash the dirty dishes yes i might be a little bit mental but it's okay but the kitchen sink after you wash your dishes or before you wash your dishes or after you wash your dishes and you dry them put them away you need to clean that sink like that sink needs to be cleaned like the, the, it needs to be cleaned okay like it needs to be cleaned I don't understand why people don't do this. The kitchen floor needs to be swept and mopped every single day, okay? Every mother freaking day. The countertops, they need to be cleaned every single day. I, um, and then we're gonna move on to the bathroom because like, I don't know why people do this, but like, some people really don't know how to clean their bathrooms and it's like, it does. Oh! No, 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 wait, no. Um, in the bathroom, okay, first of all, you use the toilet every day. That needs to be cleaned every day, okay? Flashing does not count as cleaning. You need to put that Domestos bleach in there or you need to use that hard pick, that toilet cleaner. And also, I would say, if you're using the hard pick toilet cleaner, add in some sif in there and... 
some sif in there okay put some sif in there as well scrub that toilet okay the bowl the inside when you finish uh, then deal with the actual seat of the toilet that needs to be scrubbed as well that needs to be cleaned lift that sit up and clean underneath it and wipe the actual toilet itself and let's not forget the actual outer part of the port like the, the bowl of the toilet like the bottom part that no one ever sees that needs to be fucking cleaned like uh, people seem to forget that that area exists that shit's disgusting like that needs to be cleaned moving on from that the motherfucking floor needs to be wiped every single day okay like it, it, like if you oh my god the brush the brush that you used to clean the toilet with that bowl that the brush goes back into yeah please kindly um pour out the water from that wash that thing and then put it back in when the brush obviously you've used it and you cleaned it, 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 it. Ew! Or like at least they put some Dettol in there and water and leave the brush in there after. Fucking bathtub needs to be clean. I don't know why this is something that I even have to say. The bathtub needs to be cleaned on a daily basis. I don't understand people that can just shower and get along with their day and not wash it. The bathtub needs to be cleaned. Sif, Vicol, whatever you use you need to clean it okay i, I i'm sorry you, you, i don't care whether you had a bath or it's just a shower you need to clean it don't forget the walls as well the actual walls in your shower they need to be cleaned okay if you have one of these uh, clear see-through shower curtains and please uh, like the best thing you can do for yourself get some vicor and spray down that curtain and you can leave it on the whole day and then rinse it off with hot water towards the end of the day if no one's going to be using the bathroom that also depends with like who you live with and all that stuff and whatnot but like your shower curtain needs to be cleaned your shower curtain needs to be actually removed if it's like one of those shower curtains that can be like that machine washable or remove it and chuck it in the washing machine at least uh, every week Y'all yeah, are disgusting. Some of you be having curtains that haven't been washed in a month. Like it makes me want, oh, we're not even gonna get there yet. We're not even there yet. We're not even there yet. Wait. And then after the, make sure all those other parts are clean. Uh, please wash your sink. You know the sink, the dirt in the bathroom sink, how visible that ish is. Like you can see it. You can, it's very visible. You can see it. Just think about what that sink goes through. You brush your teeth, you're spitting it. You brush your teeth, you're spitting it. You wash your face in it. Some people also wash their knickers in there. Like, just, just, please, just. You finish doing your poo, you go and wash your hands there. Just, please, just. Yes, also, you don't use your fingers to wipe your bum hole. You use tissue, but my point is, like. Um, while we're on um, while we're still on the bathroom situation i was just gonna talk about bath towels uh if uh if i see that your personal bath towel is crusty don't offer me a bath towel do not <laughs> do not you know them crunchy ones like them real crunch crunch ones like it also makes me wonder what else is crunchy like when was the last time you bought a new pair of boxes? When was the last time you bought a new pair of knickers? Like, ill. Um, like don't ill. No, no, no. Like that also even makes me wonder. Like, oh, when was the last time you changed your bed sheets? Like, do you change your bed sheets every week? Do you change your pillowcases every three days? Uh, okay, so. Oh, every single point I'm saying in this video is just making me really nervous to say. Um, if your house is like a very funny smell, like you know, one of them like unexplained funny smells, like you don't have a dog, but your house smells like you have a wet dog in there. Please explain that to me. Like, how does that make sense? Like, please explain that part to me. You don't have a dog. You don't have a pet. Why does your house smell like there's a wet dog in there? Why does your house smell like there's an actual animal that potentially... Like, there's just some weird, unexplainable smell. Like, I can't figure out, like, is it a dying cat? Is it a dead dog? Is it potentially your insides dying? Like, I, mm, like what is it? Like, just, 
and people need to stop using air freshness as like the be all and all to say that that's gonna mask all the smells listen clean your house clean your house open your windows that's the best air freshener you can have clean your house open your windows if you're really into like wanting to have like certain scents in your house either use candles or oil diffusers fucking air freshener ghetto i'm sorry air freshener is the most ghetto thing ever like ghetto i don't understand why those things were invented like air freshener is a ghetto ghetto like no unless it was like a neutralizing air freshener fair enough but those scented ones please light up a candle okay that's the best air freshener you can have light up a candle use an oil diffuser fucking air freshener get rid of that sh like ew another thing like i don't know why this is like a common occurrence in people's houses but like if you have some random looking weird stain somewhere like obviously there's like certain stains you can see like okay that's mold okay maybe you need to open your windows more often that's another thing as well like try and keep on top of that them random stains on the wall that are not explainable do you know how uncomfortable that makes me like why, why are they random stain like what, what is that like what happened like who by who why what did the person do like also i'm not hinting that like every random stain means that like someone was like oh. but like Miss Jackson. Miss <laughs> Jackson. That random stain on your carpet that you're trying to cover up with putting the table on there, or you decide to put the thingy, the chair on it, or you decide to put a vase or a plant on there to try and cover up that random stain. What happened there? Like what? What? What happened? Um, okay, this. We're just gonna move on. We're just gonna talk about the lounge real quick. Um, I, I, um, mm, I, I so. Listen, I mm. people that like putting their feet on tables, you're your actual demons. Like you're ew, like you're disgusting. Your feet. You're putting your sweaty feet. Your stinky feet that you took out from your trainers that Lord knows when was the last time you washed them. You're taking out your feet of the socks that lord knows when was the last time they saw a bar of soap you're ew like no like ew yo like tables are just meant for putting products on there not your feet like jesus christ like you was oh i just remembered something i just remembered something okay this is the last opinion that i have this is the last opinion i have um this particularly caters for me so for some people it might not as much but do not invite me to your house all right do not invite me to your house if you're not willing to cater for my dietary needs do not invite me to your house it's that simple that that do, do, do you expect me to do grocery so that i can come see you hey don't invite me don't, mm, do not invite me you're going to me now i need to do grocery the grocery that should have been going to my house now i'm buying groceries so i can come see you nah no 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 thank you no keep that invite to yourself if you're not willing to cater for my dietary needs do not invite me it's like inviting someone to say like oh let's go on a date and then you're expecting them to pay that's stupid that's real dumb like no like ew me yes i know the way i eat is not particularly like ideal for everybody else and some people might be like oh my god that's so crazy expensive blah 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 don't invite me to your house if you're not willing to cater for it if you're like listen i've been like plant-based for 11 years ain't no way i'm about to now try and make things be convenient for you if uh, you invited me to your house so please be aware that number one i do not drink regular milk i do not eat regular yogurt I do not eat regular cheese. I have certain meat substitutes that I like. If you're not willing to buy them, because yes, they can be expensive, then be willing very much to have a shitload of vegetables available in your house that I can make or that you can prepare for me. It, it, it's just, 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 just like. Just don't. Do not invite people 
to your houses if you're not willing to cater for the dietary just don't that's just rude do you realize how rude that is like it's beyond the rude don't do it like seriously but anyways yeah that's pretty much all i had to share for this video um if you want to cause a havoc you want to choose violence today please share this video go share it i'm begging you to go share it because you're choosing violence today go share this video go especially like you know the family group chat like the whatsapp group like whatsapp family group chat go dash it and leave like just to dash it and then add certain aunties possibly uncles but specifically aunties because aunties will be probably more offended by it unless if like the there's a there's very rare a very small percentage of men that are very particular about how the house is kept send it to aunties just go dash and be like at auntie at auntie at auntie at this one at this one at oh, god. god please i'm encouraging you choose violence today okay all right so if you enjoyed this video feel free to share comment like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video bye